to you the right test or road test of my Teverun Fighter 11 Plus. In this video, I'm gonna share to you my observations regarding the performance of Teverun Fighter 11 Plus. If you are new in this channel, please subscribe and hit the bell button for you to be updated for my upcoming videos. So first, I will show you my observations once you turn on the uh, Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus. So first, I will show you the screen, the TFT display of Tiberon Fighter. So as you can see guys, the full charge of Tiberon Fighter is up to 67, up to 67.5. So I already used this one. That's why it shows 67. So that is good. The standard um, full charge of 60 volts is 67.2. Okay. Additional information. So one after I turn on the display. So as you can see, guys, the temperature is not balanced. So for the rear motor is 22, and for the front motor is uh, 24. So this one is I didn't use. This is stable only. So as you can see, guys, the uh, battery voltage is 66.9. So once I turn on the lights. So as you can see now guys the battery voltage is 64.4 so almost uh, 2.5 volts reduced once you once I turn on the lights of uh, the Biron Fighter 11 plus so again once I turn off the lights so it will return to uh, 66.9 information so even you are riding under the sunlight so I uh, still you can see the screen here is still is visible so the settings of this is I choose the number 5 for the brightness of the uh, TFT display so some display you cannot see numbers in the screen but in a uh, Tiveron Fighter 11 plus even under the sunlight you can see still the numbers of the screen Based on my observation, the stem and then the handlebar is much more stable. So this is good for a top speed. So even you are doing a top speed, you will be confident and you will feel more safe, especially when you are at high speed. So now I am here in Alrim just to test or road test the Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus. So based on my observation, guys, the Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus it has a more torque power and maybe because of the throttle so the throttle of a Tiberun fighter is um, 300x which will give you much more torque power and so smooth to press so little press you will feel the torque power using the uh, gear 5 so i use the gear 5 to in order to test the maximum power of a Tiberun fighter 11 plus we will test at high speed the Tiberun fighter 11 plus if there is an wobble when you are using at the high speed so I just uh, tighten the damper for safety purposes okay so this is not the top speed I will use only I will test only if there is a wobble if I use at the high speed okay okay guys so now let's test at high speed if at the high speed if I will feel there is a wobble so now let's test
already test the at high speed of the Virun Fighter 11 Plus so I didn't do any wobble so the stem and the handling of the Virun Fighter Plus is uh, very stable so now let's test how many voltage it will reduce when you are at the high speed so as you can see guys the battery voltage is 65 so now let's test at high speed so as I can see in the display is 60, 60 volts. So, I can see in the display the voltage reduces uh, almost 5 volts reduces from 65 the battery voltage at high speed it will become 60.6 so almost the uh, 5 volts reduced when you are at the high speed based on my observation also the suspension of the Virun fighter are very soft so I can feel the bouncing of the hydrogen suspension now I am here in the middle of the road of Alrim bridge so now I will share to you the top speed test or maximum speed of the Virun Fighter 11 Plus. So I will show you first guys, the uh, battery voltage is 89% only plus 65 volts remaining. And I will show you my settings. So my settings as you can see is metric, 10 minutes, 15, then 11 inch, then 60 volts. So this is factory settings guys, I didn't change anything after I purchased so after I received the Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus so this is the same settings from the factory okay guys so in this video I will share to you the uh, different types of speed from gear 3 gear 4 and gear 5 so that 3 we will test how many kilometers per hour it will reach the top speed of uh, Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus okay guys so now let's reduce in gear 3 so the battery voltage is 87 uh, 64.8 volts ok guys so now let's test So now let's test in gear 4 with the battery voltage of 87%, 64.8. So now let's test the top speed so as you can see guys gear 5 89 percent 65 volts test how many kilometers per hour it will reach okay guys
therefore conclude that the maximum speed of Tiberon Fighter 11 Plus is 84 kilometers per hour. So based on manual, the maximum speed is 85. So I think the main reason why it didn't reach the 85 kilometers per hour is because I used the electric scooter with a battery voltage of 65, 89% only. So I think if the scooter is fully charged, it will uh, reach up to 85 or more than 85 kilometers per hour. And also for the gear 4, the maximum speed is uh, 72 kilometers per hour. For the gear 3, the maximum speed is uh, up to 57 kilometers per hour. So that is the top speed from gear 3, gear 4, and gear 5. And that's all for today the honest review of the Biron fighter 11 plus so next upload we will try the maximum range and honest review also of uh, the Biron fighter 11 plus <laughs>